Hi there, my name is Liam, technical manager here at Prima, otherwise known as Yarmanac, and welcome to our latest video. Uh, as always, this video is powered by Seagate, we thank for their continued support. So today is more of a product awareness uh, and brand awareness. Now, here at Prima, we're not just a one-trick pony, we do offer multi-brand, multi-disciplines, or through all four pillars of our business. So today we're going to be discussing this little beauty over my shoulder here, which is the Bosch Mick, or otherwise more affectionately known as the Metal Mickey. This particular version is the Mic IP Ultra 7100i. Uh, it is the 4K uh, 8 megapixel variant uh, with a 12 times optical zoom. It benefits from optical image stabilization as well as many, many other features which we cover off uh, in a second. I'm not going to show you tons of the features and how to set this up because Bosch have done some exceptional videos themselves on their own YouTube channel, which we put links to in the bio below. We will cover off quite a few of the things and how easy it is to set it up. We will show you via the web page and also through Bosch's own configuration software. We'll go through that together. There's not a lot to it and we'll discuss some of the benefits of using this particular uh, camera itself. Whether we're using it standalone, because this beauty does have the option to have two terabyte onboard storage by an SD card or you're going to use it into a VMS platform. So there's two main ways of setting this particular product up, either using the configuration manager, which is readily available from Bosch's website, or via the camera's web page. Uh, in, as you can see, either of them have a list of tabs which you can click and expand, um, and they can be adjusted as per your uh, installation requirements. So you have your camera settings, alarm settings, VCA settings, uh, basic ones such as initialization. So this obviously tells me the camera that we're using. Uh, it's running at 30 frames a second of 4K uh, using H.264 compression and orientation is normal. So that would mean it's sighted on top of a column uh, or you have the option for inverted where it's underhung or even canted where the camera is tilted slightly forward and it'd be able to have the ability to look directly down so there's no blind spots physically for the camera itself. Um, as per the requirements, as it's sighted, you can adjust this. Um, and we do recommend you set up the positioning for the camera then using this tab. And if you're unsure, what the guys at Bosch have done, they've put little how-to videos in, so you click that and it'll be give you a how-to how to set this all up properly. And then you have your camera calibration, exactly the same, you calibrate this uh, as per your requirements, so the camera does have things like software sealing, so if anyone does change the um, setup of the camera, it can generate alarms into the video management system, or even alarm scenarios. Um, it's such a great piece of kit and it's so universal. The applications are endless, from traffic monitoring, uh, critical infrastructure, perimeter protection, obviously the camera is IK10, it's rated, um, it can be used in absolutely every application you can think of, so the benefit of it, it has the window defroster, so if even in really uh, rough applications uh, it can defrost ice or even keep rain off the screen uh, even though it does benefit of a wiper it can reduce the amount of wipes to reduce strain on a particular on the wiper device itself uh, when you're setting all these things up uh, you can th use things like vca um, or you can do traditional motion detection uh, the camera has a built-in camera trainer so what you can do is you can uh, train the camera to recognize specific targets such as moving and non-moving objects the guys at Bosch have done some outstanding videos um, about to set all this up like I said I will put some links in the bio below and you can't go wrong by watching their videos um, you can do alarm rules so things such as vehicles entering an area uh, vehicles stopping at a particular point for a certain length of time all these all done by the head of the camera some really really good analytics uh, you can do uh, object filtration, whether it be human, vehicles, cars, bikes, trucks, colour. The options are endless. It's such a powerful uh, bit of kit. So you can do here, we can either use that configuration tool or we can particularly, or we can use this. So like I said, we can do the positioning, exactly the same. We can do it from here, the orientation, exactly the same as we do have the configuration tool. And uh, the recording tab, so if we did have some onboard storage by the SD card, as you can see, we have a little icon up in this corner, which is incredible. It does take up to two terabytes worth of SD card, um, which is amazing compared to most cameras, can only take up to 256 meg. Gig, sorry. So, it's such a multifunctional camera, it is so robust. Uh, it can be used absolutely everywhere and it can be you can throw everything at it um, one of the great features is this camera can even track while it's doing a tour uh, and other brands don't have the ability to do that so what you do is you have to have a camera in a fixed position the camera itself will then track once there's been an alert or a vehicle or an object has passed through an intrusion area this even on a tour can see an object 
and track it and you have the ability to set up alarm regions that can generate to your VMS platform or even the camera itself uh, and it just makes the applications for this product even better. Okay, so I've just set that to track on auto and it's going to use the video motion detection to track me in the scene just to show you how simple this is to set up. And now we're going to walk into the scene and watch the camera track me. As you can see, it's already grab hold of me. And track me whether I'm up close and personal or even further away. As you can see from the screen record there or even from the camera itself, that is how easy it is to set up. Thank you for your time watching this video today. Don't forget this product is ready real from a Prima. We're not just a one-trick pro, neither multi-brands. Thank you to the guys at Bosch for lending me this product to have a little play with. It's, it's been great. Um, if you want to see more videos or even how to fully set this up, Bosch themselves, go to the videos on the YouTube, as we've said previously. Give it a watch, give it a like, uh, and keep watching further videos. All this is ready real through a Prima. Speak to myself or any of my colleagues, uh, real distributors. Thank you. Speak to you all again soon.